It's the 25th of April, 2012. Can you tell me your name, please? Anthony Bean. And your date of birth? 30th of the 4th, 61. Uh, so what does that make you today? Uh, just shy of 51. Right. And your place of birth? Omskirt. Was that Omskirt Hospital? It was, yeah. Uh, what are your parents' names? Mary and Colin. So what's uh, your, ma your mother's maiden name? Gibbons. Okay. Um, and can you tell me what they did for a living? Uh, well, my father was a... A plumber, well, a plumber and glazer once in Southport, in Southport. And my mum was, uh, I suppose, uh, administration at the mill at Parbol. Right, Ainskers. the Ainskers yeah. flour mill. Yeah. yeah. Um, what was your primary school? Newborough. And what do you remember of, of going to Newborough school? Do you remember your first day at school at all? Vaguely, yeah. So what, what can you tell me about that? Yeah, there's a lot of... Uh, a lot of kids upset, I think, about being left for the first time. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that was uh, interesting. Yeah, that was about the main thing, yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. do you remember what your classrooms were like? Yeah, yeah. What, what were they like? Um, I suppose it was like 50s style. Yeah, it was uh, the new extension out the back, I guess. 50s extension, yeah. Right. Uh, yeah. I know the school myself. Yeah. Um, I know there's a big Victorian style. There class. is, yeah. Were you in that one? Not to start with, no. no. So, no. What, do you remember your teachers' names? Yeah, Mrs. Lang. Uh, was she the your father? Yeah, the yeah. the yeah looked after the uh, infants, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. And as you moved up through the years, did you have different teachers? Yeah, we did. Teachers? Yeah. So, do you remember your other teachers? <sighs> Yeah, there was a Mrs. Lithgow, and uh, yeah, and yeah. then uh, the headmaster, the, the new headmaster that came. And what was his name? Mr. Smith, wasn't it? Ken Smith. Was it? Yeah. yeah. So yeah. what was he like? He was all right, but yeah. forward thinking, I suppose, mm -hmm. compared to the old bloke. Yeah. 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 <laughs> so did, did you notice any difference between the two? Or yeah. The two? yeah. Yeah. Yeah, different style. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, so what sort of lessons did you do? Don't know. Just basics, wasn't it? Maths, English, uh, sports, I suppose, wasn't there? Yeah. Did you have yeah. a play a playing field? Yeah, there were two. Right. So, so I know there's one by the side of the school. There is. Where, where was the other one? And then the other one was, um, you know, where they have new preferred on. Right. So you got the playground, have you? Yeah, and then there was a, a uh, playing field next to that. Yeah. In between the playground and the vicarage. Right. Okay. So, so that was. Yeah. So that is now where they have um, like a little s slides and. Yeah, that's and right. Yeah. 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 So that was a little bit of field as well. Yeah. 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 Hmm. So, right. so what sort of st games did you play at to, to playtime? I don't know. About marbles or no, I don't think we did out like that. No, yeah, yeah, in season, yeah, yeah. So, did, did you have a special conquer, a special way of uh, doing it? No, they didn't seem to last long, did they? You got no. two games out of them, that was about it. Yeah, yeah, you didn't put them in the oven, no, no. no. <laughs> I know you'll hear some people will uh, bake them in the oven and put them in vinegar, yeah, all, all that, yeah, true. Yeah. I um, do you remember what your classroom was laid out like? Like your desks? Yeah, and, and, and all in rows, wasn't it? Yeah. Mm. So we, we, did you have single desks or twin desks? Twin. Yeah. Yeah. And who were you sat with? Who were you made to sit with somebody or... Was it yeah, just I don't the case think there was system? anybody in particular. I think yeah. you just moved around sort of thing, yeah. Right. Yeah. Uh, yeah, was, no. was it a big school or not? No. no. Um, and do you, re you know how many you reckon might have been there? I don't know. What, what do you think about? Well, I suppose it was less than that, but I suppose it was at a time when Newbury was developing, wasn't it? So more and more people were coming and yeah. didn't... Uh, Parbol lose the 11 plus, so folk from Parbol were 
sending the kids there so they could still go to grammar school. Right. So there seem to be more and more coming, yeah? Yeah. Talking of 11 plus, did, mm -hmm. did you do the 11 plus? I did. Do you remember the sort of lead up to it? Did you know what it was? Yeah, I knew we did a lot of training for it. Yeah, so what sort of things did you do? Past papers, yeah. Uh, yeah. So were you, were you aware when you were doing it that it was leading up to the 11 plus? Yeah, sort of thing, yeah. Yeah. For uh, the next move on. Yeah. Yeah. Because I know when, so to Bisper. Oh, yeah. Um, and we used to do all these little, if you like, word games on the board or whatever, and the teacher yeah. put stuff on the board, like, and codes and things like that. Yeah. And you'd be doing all that for, like, weeks. Oh, weeks and weeks before. Yeah. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> I yeah. Know when, uh, when it came to the actual 11 plus day, mm. uh, out comes the paper. It was exactly like what we've been doing. Yeah, yeah, so just the all, same. Just the same. Isn't so, it? yeah, it was a piece of cake. Yeah. Did, did you do the 11 plus at the school? Yeah. And were you in the hall or something? Yeah, the main hall. Yeah, so, so what was that like? Because that must have been the first time you'd done something yeah, like done that. Done an exam, an yeah. Exam, yeah. Yeah. Do you feel uh, intimidated? A bit daunting, I suppose, wasn't it? Yeah. 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 Um, Having done the 11 plus, how long was it, do you reckon, before you knew what you got? Well, about four weeks, something like that, was it? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and how did you know? I think, did they come round and tell you? Uh, did your parents get a letter? I think they did. Ah, yeah. 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 So, um, what, what did you put down for your schools that you, you know, because you could have either put... <laughs> Grammar schools or other schools, if you didn't pass. Do you remember mm. what your other school would have been? I thought it was just, um, you just got the choice when you passed the 11 plus, didn't you? No, you had to, no. Put, you had to put down on the... Uh, oh, that, well, <coughs> it'll have been Burska then, wouldn't it? Right. Trevor Road. Yeah. Yeah. Because, uh, I mean, the other one, I, I think I put Croston then. Yeah. But, yeah, Burska yeah. is probably the, the, the closest one. Yeah. You wouldn't have gone to Wigan Road. No. Nah. No. Um, so having passed the 11 plus, which I presume you did. Yeah. Because um, that's when I met you at that's grammar, right, grammar yeah. school. That's right, yeah. What was it like going to grammar school? Yeah, that was a bit daunting at first as well, yeah. Big fish, yeah. A small fish in a big yeah. pond. Sort of yeah, yeah. Uh, and do you remember your first day there? Yeah, yeah. Uh, so what, what happened when you went there, was it? All, all in together, or...? Yeah, did they let us start a bit later or something? I think, I think we did, yeah, yeah. all met in the hall, and then we all got a, a couple of names called out, and you went into that class. Yeah. Did yeah. anybody come with you from Newbury? Yeah, they did, yeah. How many? Oh, that's good. Roughly. Well, would it be about six or eight. Right, yeah. Yeah. And did, did, were you with anybody in your classes or not? Uh, there, was, there was only one, one that John Lambert, and that was yeah. all, yeah. Yeah, because yeah. I think we had well, Ian Kirkbride. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, there's an interesting story about mm -hmm. that. Tell us that. Oh, well, the... When we were all in the yeah, hall. Yeah, and uh, his, his name got called out Kirkbridge or something, wasn't it? That's right, yeah. And... Uh, he never moved, but um, they left him there, didn't they? Right till right to the end. Yeah. And uh, yeah. <laughs> I, I don't know whether that's your parents writing or somebody couldn't read properly, but um, yeah. Uh, but that's Kirk you. Bridge, yeah. yeah. We're all saying, weren't we? That's you. That's that you, yeah. yeah. And he's right, like say, right yeah. to the end. Who are you, boy? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I haven't got you down there. That's right. Adding an extra G. Yeah. <laughs> mm. So. How did you find the grammar school compared to the uh, junior school? Mm, yeah, hard work at first. Yeah. And were the classes different? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Uh, how, how so? A lot more regimented, I suppose, wasn't it? Yeah. And, uh, yeah. A lot more work. Not as easy. Mm. Yeah. We did homework. Oh, ah, yeah. 
did you have homework at the junior school or not? Not as I can remember, no. no. So, so coming into... Yeah, it was a big... Big thing. And, yeah. And, uh, yeah. So do you, know, do you remember how much homework you got at a night? There's always at least something to do every night, wasn't there? Yeah. Yeah. yeah Depending were... on what classes yeah. you'd had in the day, I suppose, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah. I think there were about three subjects in ah, the, yeah. every night. Ah, yeah. Yeah. Should take about an hour. <laughs> Yeah. Hi. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. um, having you know moved, you were then moved through the school. Yeah. Um, when it came to doing all levels, and well, it was all levels in those days. Wasn't was it? yeah. Uh, just about. I think we just had the last. Yeah, the last of them. I. Yeah, before they went to GCSEs. Mm. Um, did you get any advice on how to go, which direction to go with your all levels? <laughs> No, none at all, really. No. So, how did you decide what you wanted to do? Uh, it was just pure. Well, probably the strongest subjects at the time. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, yeah, no direction at all at the time. No. So, careers advice was there anything? Non-existent. Like that? No, uh, no. It was, it was all about. Getting you to university, that's all. That's yeah. all they were interested in. Right, because I remember they, they did have a, a little room somewhere, didn't they? They did, yeah. yeah full of dusty old... Books, magazines, yeah. yeah. No use. Yeah. Mm -mm. Do you remember the names of your teachers at uh, the grammar school? Yeah, uh, I think Mr Barber was the first form teacher. Yeah. Yeah. Um, all sorts of that. And if you went through oh, English. Uh, yeah, English. Miss Mason. Yeah. If she yeah. Uh yeah. Because she looked after the library, didn't That's she? That's right, yeah. Do you remember the first time in the library? Yeah. What, what did she make you do? Well, well, what was she, she showed you, didn't she? She showed you how to uh, read a book and open a book properly. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> um Aye. What about maths? Who, who did you have for maths? Hmm. Oh, I don't know. I mean, it, was Miss, it was Mr Banks. Yeah, no, it wasn't him. Um, Mr um, Robertson? Yeah, Smokey Joe. Yeah, yeah. Right, yeah. 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 <laughs> no, I don't think we had him either, no. Was there, was there a new guy they brought in from... Uh, oh, uh, oh, oh it, Mr Hiley? Hiley, yeah, that was yes. it, yeah. yeah. Yeah, he was really good in, wasn't he? He yeah. was, yeah. 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 I think people got on with him. More That's than right. Else. Possibly because he was younger. Maybe, yeah. The rest of them all were... Well, they all, well, literally, well. literally the old school. Yeah, literally, yeah. 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 So, um... Ah, so, I mean, yeah. Who else? There was, Mr. was Mr. Gray there. Um, was he maths? No, he was English. All oh, right. Oh, ah, yeah. History. Who Jack was, Evans yeah. and... Uh, oh, God, who else was there? Geography. Oh, there was it's an old woman, wasn't That's it? That's right, yeah. Oh, God, I can't think of her name. Um, no, I can't either. Hey-ho. Yeah. Geography, yeah. Well, it was Miss Swindells, wasn't it? That's and right, yeah. DJ Evans. Yeah. Yeah. Um, uh, and then, wasn't there a... Oh, was it Mrs Bottomley? Oh, yes, I think yeah. her name was Smith first. Enough, That's right, because her husband had a... A lot oh, to no, do. I know, I know what you mean. Yes, yeah, so I'm, I'm, I'm thinking of, I'm thinking of biology there. Right. Yeah. Right. Smith. Yeah. Well, her husband had a lot to do at Central New Town, at, in you know, Leyland, oh, surely okay. around there. Right. So. Mm. Yeah. So yeah. Uh, when it came to games and things, yeah, what did we do in we games? In the gym, on it, and then yeah. rugby. Yeah. Cricket in the summer. Yeah. Yeah. How did you get on? No, not so good. No. no I, didn't. I mean, did you find that they actually taught you anything, or was it just a case of turning up? It was just turning up, wasn't it? And those, I guess those that they thought had talent, nurturing them. They forget about the rest of you. Yeah. Yeah, just turn up, yeah. Just two hours a week. That's it, yeah. Filling in the time. What a waste time. of time, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Cross country and that, yeah. yeah. <clears throat> Cross country walk. Yeah. That's usually yeah. what it was. Yeah, true. He used to come round in his car. Yeah. <laughs> checking up on you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, come the time when uh, 
you know, we did, we've, done, we've done your O levels. Um, yeah. What choices did you have then? Well, yeah, A levels, wasn't it? So, uh, yeah, I just went with the uh, the strongest subjects in my O levels. Yeah. Yeah. What were they? Geography, geology, which we haven't done before, but when I suppose that went hand in hand with the geography, didn't it? Yeah. And uh, I think I did biology as well. Right. Yeah. Okay, so I mean, got that far. Right. Uh, we're then looking at either on to university yeah. or into a job, I suppose, yeah, or further true. education of some description. True. What, what did you do? With that? So, yeah, I looked at going to university, but yeah. uh, unfortunately didn't get the grades, so. Right. Didn't make it. Yeah. So. Um, so then, sort of like went to retake at Wigan Tech, and then uh, in the meantime, the old headmaster, next to my mum, saw uh, an advert for uh, a technician, science technician at ROF. Right. And so applied for that, got so, that. So what was the ROF? Royal Ordnance Factory. And where was that? Chorley, Exton. Right. Okay, and, and uh, so how did you get on there then? All oh, right, yeah, it was good. And what sort of things were you doing? If, if you can tell Testing me. Testing all sorts, <laughs> yeah. Explosives, textiles. Out that was used by the uh, MOD, really. Right. It was, uh, yeah, good grounding. Yeah. In science, yeah. Yeah, chemistry, yeah. So how long did you stay there then? Ten years. Right. And what, why did you leave that? Well, because it was like, you know, the the end of the Cold War and like they were looking to relocate down south and, and I didn't want to move, wanted to stay around here. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. And, uh, so where did you go after that? So, well, I was lucky. Um, as someone I'd worked with, the ROF, who'd um, he'd, he'd left and managed to get a job at Rentkill at Kirby, he was right. like lab manager there, yeah. and then he knew I weren't happy, so yeah. uh, and a vacancy came there, so uh, he offered me the job, so yeah. I went there. So what were you doing at Rentkill? Uh, QC lab manager. Right. Yeah, running my QC lab. Right. So, so were they? I mean, you think of rent to kill as rat poison. Yeah. Is is that all they did, or were they doing other things? Oh well? no, it's contract packing for uh, Brian to May. Right. Um, you know, gas uh, lighter gas cylinders filling them. They had a, an aerosol line, so fly sprays for, for boots. Oh. Uh, turtle wax um, upholstery cleaners and. Uh, Car shiners, right. everything really. Yeah, so it's quite, it's quite a diverse. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. Of it, well, yeah, it's just like the contract packing side, but they still have their own core business of like rat poison and uh, sanitary stuff, I suppose. Yeah. 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 yeah I mean, you think of rat poison, and it is dangerous stuff. Yeah. Do you have any precautions that you had to take when you were working with it, or? Uh, they should have been, but I don't suppose they were keen as on health and safety then days. But yeah. like you say, there's some nasty stuff. Mm. I mean, I presume were you touching it all the time, or uh, only on lab scales, really? Yeah. You know, on lab so lab scale. On a, no, not uh, large quantities. No, of no. Yeah. So, I mean, did no. you have the facilities for washing your hands? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And keeping yourself clean. Yeah, and true, stuff. and gloves and that. Right. Yeah. So how long were you there then? Well, I only stuck that two years because uh, no, it was um, it was just like a little workhouse. Yeah, I don't I don't mind work, but that was slavery. Mm, right. Uh, so then another lad I worked with at the uh, ROF, he got out and got a job at Petrolite. Same scenario. He was looking for a vacancy to fill. He knew I wasn't happy, so he offered me the job, yeah. got the job. So did you have to have an interview? Or? Aye, but it was a formality. Right, yeah. so it's not like today when you've got hundreds applying or whatever, you know, lots of people would apply for 
one job. No, I'd been for jobs uh, previously and uh, never got them. You right. know, it was only the fact that he'd moved there and yeah. he knew what I was like. Yeah. And so that's where you still are? Really. Still are, yeah. yeah. 20 years yeah. since, yeah. Waiting for retirement. Mm. <laughs> Can't in, wait. In another 15 years. <coughs> years, yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Um, when you were younger, did you go on holiday? Yeah. Where, where did you go? Blackpool, Scarborough, Newquay. I believe we went to Newquay in Wales one year as well. Yeah. Yeah. So it wasn't the same place every year? Yeah. You know, different no. Different places every yeah. Went on. Yeah, Isle of Man. Yeah. Yeah. So how did you get to the Isle of Man? Ferry from Liverpool. Right. And yeah. Took the car along. No, no. No. No, full passengers. Yeah. 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 So what, what sort of things would you have done at, to, when you were at these places? I don't know. Just on the beach, I suppose, if it was yeah. fine, wasn't it? Yeah. Cheapest option. Making yeah. sandcastles, yeah. I'm assuming you sort of, I yeah. don't know, eight, nine, ten, somewhere like that. That's there, right, yeah. That yeah. 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 Aye. Um, <laughs> you, you, you were brought up around in the Hosker. Yep. Area. What was it like living around here? Quiet. Because it's mainly agriculture, isn't it? Cheers, yeah. So, um, yeah. Did you make use of public transport a lot or not? Only to Wigan and Southport, really, with yeah. my mum. And how was that on Shopping, the train? Shopping, train, yeah. 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 What about buses? I occasionally bus Tomskirk, I suppose. Yeah. Yeah. Do you remember the steam trains? Just. Yeah. Yeah. Because um, I don't. Uh, right. It's, it's something that passed me by. Mm. Uh, I mean, 68, they went out of service. Um, I mean, my dad had a car, so mm. he went in a car, you know. And, yeah. Um, no noisy things, I don't seem to yeah. remember. And, yeah. yeah. I, don't, I don't remember him at all. Oh, I. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and what about, um, you know, shopping around here? What, where would you go shopping? Well, a South Port or Wigan on train. Yeah. And maybe Omsker can car. Yeah. That'd be about it. So what, what sort of shops would you be going to? Do you remember the shops that... Um, I suppose they did have supermarkets by then. Not like they are today, but... Uh, no. Well, I suppose the... Tesco was in Bursko at first supermarket, wasn't it? Yeah. And the East. Yeah. Yeah. So what else was in Bursko shop-wise that you remember? Butchers, couple of butchers, weren't there? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, Greengrocers. Mm. Aye. News the, agents. Yeah, do you remember the names of them? Walton's news agent, yeah. yeah. Uh, Mullis's, the butcher. Yeah. Fred Ankin had a shop there, that was a butcher's shop. Uh, then there was a couple under Randa, wasn't there? Shops like yeah. Because yeah. didn't your dad work in Burska? He did later on when he yeah. finished up in Southport. Yeah, he right. got finished up. Yeah, Burska Glass. Yeah, yeah. down Horrell Lane. Which I believe they've now knocked down. Well, yeah. no, it's a private dwelling. Yeah. 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 Aye. yeah. Uh, what about um, your neighbours where you live? Did, did you have interesting neighbours? Yeah, Mr. Gladwin. He was a uh, headmaster at some special school in uh, Liverpool. Yeah. Yeah, he was there. Major influence, I guess, yeah. 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 Definitely uh, steered you in that direction, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Later, right. later on, when you grew up and you were 18, yeah. he hinted, um, yeah. <laughs> with that age, uh, uh, what about the pubs around here? There's one or two, isn't there? Yeah, just what, tavern, really. Yeah. And the ring yeah. of bells next door. Well, yeah, never really. Bothered with that no. place. So, so what, what do you remember in the tavern? The, el <laughs> the electric pump. Yeah. Yeah. Smoky. Yeah. Very. Compared to now. Yeah. I mean, you say electric yeah. pump. I mean, this was for draft beer. It was, yeah. Did they have the hand pumps then or not? No. No. No, definitely not. Electrics. Yeah. 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 
Uh, what about lager and stuff like that? I suppose that would be just on his now, isn't it? On nitrogen. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Uh, well, I think there's stuff, like you said, in the the, the glass valve thing. That, that were it, yeah. Balls. I think yeah. pumping up uh, draft beer, but... It's just electrically. Really electrically, yeah. 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 Instead of on the hand pump. That's right. They use now. Yeah. Uh, remember what sort of beer they had there? Tetley's, wasn't it? Yeah. And what were you drinking? Tetley Mild. Yeah. And what, was it busy? That pub? Yeah, very. Especially at weekend. Yeah. Hmm. It was the landlord down there. <laughs> George and Audrey, yeah. Right. Uh, long gone. I've no, George Audrey. Had, oh. Audrey died, didn't she? She did, yeah. Yeah, but George is still going. Yeah. 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 I saw him the other morning walking yeah. the dog. Aye. Yeah. yeah. Um, <laughs> what do you remember about you know, the sort of area where we are now in, in the sort of Latham Hosker area? I mean, it's uh, it, it's been, well renowned if, if you like for the canal side yeah. of things because I know you. Granddad. Tell me about your granddad. Yeah, he worked on canal, yeah. yeah. Uh, and what, what, what was he? Bargy. Yeah. Yeah. And he had his own boat. Well, I suppose he, he didn't own it, did he? I don't know. But, you know, he was... Yeah. So who did he work for? Oh, oh gosh, it began with A, didn't it? A No. Uh, was it... Um, um... Yeah, it was, Yeah. Yeah, but mm. um, he, he was he was uh, employed, employed by somebody though. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. what did he what did he do? What was he carrying? I don't know. In the early days, when it um, grain from Birkenhead to um, Burskaria. Yeah. And then latterly coal, wasn't it, to from Wigan to Liverpool, Bank yeah. Coal Power Station. Yeah. Right. Did he ever go on his barge? Only when it was tied up here. Right, you didn't go with him at all. No, right? no, it was too small. Like. Right, yeah. 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 In, in the holidays or something like that, he didn't take you up the canal. No, never. No. Never, no. <laughs> so, yeah. when did he retire then? I know he's not with us anymore. But, uh... Oh, well, when he got finished up there, um, he went to Miller Parbold, didn't he? So, right. I say, when did he retire? I suppose it'll have been. Uh, Early 70s, wasn't it? Yeah. 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 And he lived in this house. He did, yeah. yeah. He did, yeah. When we were there. Aye. <laughs> yeah. So, 